Hey guys, this is Elix Gaming Life Safety Guy. Right here we have a special unboxing from Keda, a fire alarm company, mainly known for their fire extinguishers and smoke alarms. You may be wondering, well, what is this box doing right here? Well, if you didn't know, in 2017, Keda recalled nearly almost 4 million fire extinguishers due to inconsistencies with their products. These products were made between 1973, I believe, and 2017, where their fire extinguishers had plastic handles and most of the times failed to discharge during emergencies. And so far there has been 300 reports of these extinguishers failing during a need to use the extinguisher for an actual fire has started and there has been one fatality that has been reported. Now, here's a short clip that I got explaining what happened on Kiddo's part. It was one of the biggest recalls in government history. Millions of Kitta brand fire extinguishers were recalled over serious defects. And as consumer investigator Lauren Verna reports, new evidence shows Kitta may have failed to report problems for years. It's a brand name synonymous with fire safety, but a new consumer reports investigation finds reports of serious problems with Kitta brand fire extinguishers. We sifted through years of lawsuits and publicly reported complaints and found allegations that Kitta knew of the problem with its fire extinguishers for years before they finally issued a recall in 2015 and again in 2017. A judge recently ordered Kitta to pay a $12 million fine as part of a consent decree settling allegations by the Department of Justice at the company knowingly misled the government about the extent and scope of the problems with some of its products. Kitta did not admit that it violated federal law as part of the settlement. A Kitta spokesperson said, quote, Kitta is committed to ensuring our products are safe and dependable, especially those related to life safety, such as fire extinguishers. But that's not all. Consumer Reports also found reports on the CPSC website of consumers saying Kitta bungled the recall. In some cases, replacing a recalled fire extinguisher with another recalled fire extinguisher. Among reasons for the recall problems, Kitta says that they learned some of the replacement units were, quote, damaged in transit, adding that the company has since taken steps to provide working extinguishers to customers who received damaged devices. So as you can see, Kitta is sending out free fire extinguishers to those who submit a report that have a faulty fire extinguisher. If I get my extinguisher that was in the recall, or was recalled, here it is. As you can see, it has the plastic handle. Plastic handle, not, not good. It needs to be metal. As you can see, it's on the green. I'm going to go ahead and get this a little closer, but I don't want to tip over the camera, though. But you can see, it's on the green. I uh, haven't been, haven't used this, um, here's the bottom of it, so you can see it's an ABC fire extinguisher, handle classes, classifiers A, B, and C. So now that I got that out of the way, I just wanted to put that information out there. Let's go ahead and see what Kitta sent me. So this is quite a big box, so... Wasn't expecting this to come this soon. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put the plug to the other side and open this box. Be careful while opening the boxes. Alright. Let's go ahead and see. What's this? Okay, that's something else. And it looks like we have a letter explaining what to do. So, if we go ahead and open this box completely, we have a brand new, paid for, brand new fire extinguisher. 
did not pay a cent for this because they messed up on their part and produced faulty extinguishers. Let's go ahead and open this. like oh the user manual is a bit ripped but you can see it came with its user manual on how to operate this extinguisher put that to the side and I believe yes it did it came with its inspection tag this can focus there we go so you can see inspection tag oh yeah it's paper This is the mounting bracket. Just put it on the wall, hang it. And here is the fire extinguisher. As you can see, it's brand new in box. Obviously made by Kida. And the difference between my recalled fire extinguisher and the new extinguisher is this one has a plastic handle. While well, this one has a metal handle. Also, this one has a plastic uh, safety pin, while this one has a metal safety pin. And they're f both on full. So yeah, and I believe we can look on the bottom, see the date, as you can see. Brand new, 2021. So this will last me until, I believe, 2031 so this is good for about 10 years I believe 10 years I think that's the minimal requirements for fire extinguishers but yeah this is a brand new fire extinguisher this is the old recalled fire extinguisher but looks like I have two now and I I believe I do have to return this one though but I think I might keep it just because I don't think you have to return it but, uh, yeah, I like this. What's this? Okay, in fire emergency pool to remove. Okay. Little safety thingy tag. But, yeah, that's the Kitta multi purpose, multi purpose fire extinguisher. Fire extinguishers. It's BL rated and I believe rated for A, B, and C fires. Yes, it is. And it is also dry chemical, so it has powdery residue. Might I might discharge this one just for fun on a actual fire demonstration thing. So yeah, that's mainly it. If we go ahead, take a look. Yeah, well, thanks for watching. Have a great day.